So what we have here is one of, uh, one of numerous test cars that we use, so we refer to them as a test mule. On the outside it looks a lot like a, like a standard Sportivo, but underneath in terms of powertrain, in terms of chassis, it basically has all the key features and everything that we tune to basically make the TRD product. Significantly more power, significantly more torque, means that we really need to transfer that to the road and, and turn that into something that is, is drivable, is smooth, and is something that enhances the overall performance experience. And the way that we have to do that is not by suspension in isolation, not by wheels and tyres in isolation, but looking at how all of that integrates together. Uh, the springs are stiffer and they're lower, really about trying to uh, introduce some more control into the body to improve the overall handling performance and really increase the amount of agility that we have in the vehicle. We also retune the shock absorbers, so the damping force has changed so that once again to overall to improve the ride and handling balance into something that really is a very enjoyable, entertaining vehicle that's agile but is also very comfortable to live with. We need to come up with a, a pretty special brake package and something that really fits in with the, with the DNA of the vehicle. We're not looking for something that is off a race car, we're looking for something that is refined, something that offers levels of performance that you'd expect from a performance road car. We go to larger rotors, performance calipers, which are twin piston aluminium calipers. It's about having a system which works well, which is quiet, which has the quality feel, and which has really surprisingly good performance. One of the key things that we chase is what opportunities there are to really tighten up the chassis and make it as rigid as possible. The one thing that we have found significant improvements in a number of areas is replacing the rear bumper structure. We replace this with a restructure reinforcement, which is an extruded aluminium part which really serves to improve the overall experience in a number of ways. Things like improving steering response, improving the agility of the vehicle, and giving it a structurally taut feel to the chassis.